in the next two videos I'm going to talk about the shapes in PyMonk. So in this first video I'm going to cover how to create the basic shapes, so the circle, the box and the line segment. And in the next video I'm going to cover how to create uh, some custom shapes like this triangle or this uh, pentagon. So first of all let's go to the pymang.org and I'm here in the API reference and as you see here is the pymang.shape when you open it it is the base class for all, for, for the, all the other shapes so base class for all the shapes. You usually don't want to create instances of this class directly, but use one of the specialized shapes instead, circle, poly or the segment. So this pyman shape is only for um, inheriting from it. So here is the circle and the poly and the segment. So, and here are also the moments for the circle, for the poly and for the segment for calculating the moment, moment of inertia. Okay, then let's start. I'm going to create a mass variable, which I'm going to set it just zero. And I'm going to create a new, let's call it radius. Oops, radius and it will be 30. Then create a circle. Circle moment. So let's calculate imang dot moment for circle and moment for circle. So as you see, it needs a mass, an inner radius and an outer radius, so a mass, I'm going to give it the mass, inner radius will be zero and the outer radius, let's say 30. So if you go here, moment for circle, mass, inner radius and outer radius. Okay, now let's create a body, so circle body, and this will be the pymang dot body, mm, the capital B body, and its first argument is also the mass. The second argument is the moment, so circle moment we calculated here. And now this is just the body definition. Now we are going to create the shape itself. So circle underscore shape and this will be equal to pymang dot circle. So it needs a body. We create it here. So circle body and it also needs a circle radius. We have here the radius. Okay. Now, uh, of course, every time you create a body and a shape, you need to add them to the space. So I'm going to here, space that add circle body and comma circle shape so let me see what we have oh this is the previous so this is zero five shapes and we had here a circle of course it it's falling down so i'm going to 
set the gra space gravity on Y to zero so it won't fall down. And here it is. Now I'm going to set its position, the body's position. So circle body that position and on the X 100 and on the Y 100 as well. So now it's offset from the lower left corner 100 on X and 100 on Y to the center of the circle. So now create a square or a box but first of all I'm going to change this to 30 here to radius okay now give it a name which will be poly shape or well yes poly shape why not mm. so poly shape first mm, Create the shape with pymang.poly mm, with a capital P poly that create box for the body. Uh, let me see. So here it is the poly, and it has this create box method, static method. So it needs a body and its size is by default 10, uh, 10 and 10 so for the body I'm just going for now give it none and the size will be size will be a tuple of 50 and 50 and now let's calculate a moment so poly underscore moment and pymunk dot moment for poly moment for poly it also needs as you see a mass the vertices so the mass will be mass and the vertices will be the poly shape Holy shape that get vertices. Okay. Now create a body for the poly. So poly underscore body will be the pymank dot body. And it also needs a mass. And it needs the second argument is the moment we calculated here for the poly so I'm going to copy and paste it then after I created a body I'm going to set the shapes body to this body so poly shape dot body equal to poly body poly body and I'm going to set the body's position so poly body poly body dot position equal to let's say 250 on X and 100 on Y so let's run it and of course we need to add it to the space so poly body and poly shape and don't forget always add the body and the shape as well to the space okay now this uh, box is placed from the bottom left corner 250 50 on, y, on X and 100 on Y to the center of the box 
And now lastly, just create a segment. So segment underscore moment pymunk pymunk dot moment for a segment. Yes. So the moment for a segment, here it is. It needs a mess, a point A and a point B. A mass will be mass. So this value. And point A will be a tuple of, uh, I'm going to set it to 0 on x, 0 on y, and point B also a tuple 0 on x, and let's say 400 on y. And it also needs a radius, or in this case it's the thickness of the line. So I'm going to set it to 2. Let's create a body. So segment underscore body is pymunk dot body and give it a mass and a segment moment segment moment and now let's create a shape for this segment so segment underscore shape will be equal to pymunk dot segment and it needs a body so segment dot body or segment underscore body the point a which will be the same as here so zero zero uh, zero comma zero and a point b which will be also the same as here so 0 and 400 and also needs uh, thickness or a radius so let me see pymunk segment they call it radius but in in the case of this line segment as i said it's the thickness of the line okay and now let's set it's the po uh, segment body's po position so position equal to uh, let's move it 400 on x and 100 on y and we also need them to add to the space so segment body and the segment shape so let go let's go and take a look Here. Okay, so the circle is the first, its position is 100, 100, 100, 100. Then this uh, box or the square is 200 and 100. Here it is. And the line segment, which is uh, the 400 and on x and 100 on y from this point for from the bottom point and it and it goes to 0 and 400 on y so the second point is here 